160 million Americans breathe unhealthy air. And just a few weeks ago, air pollution along the Wasatch was at dangerous levels. But according to the EPA, the air pollution levels inside your home can be two to five times higher than the outside levels. In the last couple of months, John Hopkins with Zero Res has demonstrated the importance of taking care of two big contributors of indoor pollutants. Your carpet and your air ducts were two of those things you've demonstrated and showed us to us. And now we're talking about that air quality. John, don't tell me this is what this is what we're breathing. Unfortunately, the last time we were on your show, the air duct that we showed, yeah. this was the filter that was guarding that air duct. This is just clogged with all sorts of... Yes, it is. <laughs> and you wouldn't believe how many times we go into homes and we find this. This is, this is not abnormal. We see this all the time. You say it's not abnormal. So you actually took this little device here. This measures how many... Particulate. Yeah, little things floating around in the air that yes. there are, all right? Yes. And you're able to determine, go into any place and figure out how much of that sort of indoor pollutants are floating around. Sure. Right? Okay. Sure. So John took that around yesterday to a couple of places, and we have a few of those spots. We're going to show people a spot they would normally think of as being clean, and we'll find out exactly how much stuff is floating around the air. For example, first of all, went into uh, went into a restaurant. Looks like a perfectly nice, clean restaurant. You found how much parts per liter. In the in the restaurant air, twenty seven thousand six hundred. Wow, and that's anything over about twenty in the upper twenties. That's getting a little bit unhealthy. Uh, it's getting unhealthy. Okay, so a restaurant's about borderline. Then how about you go to a regular home? Go into someone's living room and you can check. I would imagine at home everything's clean. You got the air filters. Everything's going. How much would you find in the home? Well, you would hope it was clean, but it's about twenty eight thousand. Even higher than the restaurant with a bunch of public people. Uh, okay, from the home, let's go to office where many of us spend a lot of time, more time than we'd like to. An average office, you know, they have custodial crews come through, they have things cleaned up. How much is there floating around in the air at the office? 33,000. We're up to 33, breaking into the 30s now. Yes, yes. <sighs> now, we, we tested your office here and it was great. It was about 3,000, so you have an excellent system. Good, I feel much better now breathing the air around here. <clears throat> the fourth place you went to was the hotel room, and I would normally think, you know, there might be some problems with hotels, but they clean it and it should be fine. Yes. How much is in the hotel room? You don't want to know. Oh no. 83,000. 83,000 parts per liter are floating around in that? Yes, yes. And we see, we see parts per liter. We're breathing in a couple liters every every couple minutes or so. Oh aren't yes, we? a lot. It's 22,000 breaths in a 24-hour period, and you're bringing in about 7,500 parts per particulate into your lungs each time you breathe. Now, if you get into a room that's 83,000, I mean, you're really loading up. Yeah. So just like this filter, that's what happens that's in your... The, our lungs are turning into that. Your lungs and your uh, uh, throat and all the things that are attached to your lungs, this is happening. This, this is just, that is just sickening <clears throat> looking there. Okay, now I know what you were talking about last time when you said that the government has actually issued indoor air quality as one of the five biggest dangers for us that we probably Risks. don't even know about. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. So what can we do? Now that we know that we've got those problems, what are some things that we can do to well, combat that? As we started, the first thing you want to do is make sure that you've cleaned your carpet and maintained it professionally, okay. and then vacuum on a regular basis. Now that's really important, to vacuum. Now unfortunately, some of the name vacuum cleaners that are out there, the, the, the ones that are just really hitting the market and doing great sales, do not have a HEPA filter with it. So everything that they're pulling out of that carpet is now going airborne, and then once it's airborne, your cold air return system is picking that up and it's going to every room in your home. So it's really important to make sure that you vacuum with a HEPA vacuum cleaner. Okay, so we actually have five of these things we're going to talk about. Clean with a, a HEPA filter on your vacuum. What else? Clean your like just a regular air filter in your house. Does that also help? Absolutely. You have to have that professionally done. You want to make sure that you clean those filters. You have electrostatic type filter. Uh, it's very, very important to have something that really pulls things out of the air when you're doing that. Control the home chemicals, ventilate your home, get some air circulating around. But also the last one there is purify the air. And you have brought in a contraption here which will clean the air. You have your little device here that we saw. Yeah. Yes. 20, 30, 40, 80,000 parts per liter. Correct. Let's, let's now, this see is what a this Texas does. instrument machine. It's okay. very, very accurate. But this little machine is fantastic, Darren. You know, you, there's a lot of these filters out on the marketplace today. If you'll read your consumer guide, they will tell you most of these filters do not work, absolutely do not work, that your tabletop has as much ability to pull things out of the air as the machine does, and they're paying four and five hundred dollars for these things. Wow. And what's and what's so the air quality, by the way, air here, before quality we on this, this one. out here in the regular studio, before we're going to turn this on, we're getting a reading. The stuff that we're breathing in right now, is it about... It's about it's coming up. <laughs> it has to purge just for a minute. Okay, I'm, we're I'm, almost there. Okay. I'm curious we're, to we're, see what 
we're right at 10,000. 10,000, so not too bad. back and forth. But we're switching this on. This actually has a couple different filters in it. Yes, th this is an FDA class two medical device. It actually scrubs the air of particulate and kills all the bacteria, viruses, mold, all those kind of things that air filters just don't do. Okay. And so this is a great system. And we'll measure this one. Remembering that the restaurant was at about 80,000, that our regular studio here is at about 10,000, and with the air filter on. What's that number? It actually says zero there. Zero. It? It's pulled everything out of the air. You're breathing for the first time pure air. Now smell that air, Darren. It smells different. It, it does smell Because different. it's pure air. And we're okay. not used to that, obviously. Yeah. Zero Res, of course, will come to your house. They can clean everything for you. They can do all sorts of services, including the, the air filter. You guys have a special deal for those people who are watching today. We do. Anybody that calls today and books any of our services get an indoor air quality check at no charge, and they will either receive an electrostatic air filter or $100 off. Off this air purification system. Great deal. Unbelievable deal. Yeah, it really is. So if you're if you're watching today, give them a call at Zero Res. The phone number 866-937-6539. There's the phone number right there. And if you need more information, you can go to their website. That'll also hook them up with their, their phone number there, myzeroRes.com. They'll give you a free analysis of your air quality inside your house to see what you might be breathing, and then give you a couple great ways to save money to clean air up. John, thanks so much for giving us the tips Absolutely. on this. Absolutely. We can all be literally breathing easier. Yeah. After yeah. today.